and welcome everyone my name is blood how is everyone doing today and today it's tavern of legends time uh last month wasn't tavern of legends because of the uh, ninja event um i'm mainly pulling because of hell and kingston those are both two desirable ones i have as well as a bunch of other ones that aren't featured um i say we just get ready to the coin pulls i'm you know might as well Oh, wow. Okay. Well, that's a good start. We got Glinda already. I don't have her yet, and I've been wanting her, so... Hopefully, I don't get any more of her, because I don't think I need multiples of her, but... I'll definitely take that. Gotta have our Banes. Still waiting on that Dawa life. There's a Gunner. Got some reds. Oh! Well, look at that! Now I got Grazul. <laughs> um, I mean, she's good. She's good on offense. I already have uh, Vonda, so I'll probably be working on her over her. She'll just be sitting on the back burner for a while. As much as I love uh, Grazul, I think she's a great offensive tool. Because I have Vanda, I think Vanda's slightly better on offense than Grazul is. So, yeah. I, it'd be cool to put them both together and have that double uh, resistance to exist so you can have four turns of it instead of two. But outside of that, I don't see a reason to level her, especially with how many good ones I have to level. I still have Zimkeith at a level. Um, Vonda. I got another one recently I'm looking forward to leveling. Hmm. But yeah, so we're going to just probably just coin out these pulls. I don't feel like spending gems on putting any pulls in. I don't think it's worth it. Like, if you're going to do any pulls for the Tavern of Legends and you are a little bit of a spender, uh, I would do the $30 one. Don't even do the first deal because the $30 one is a genuine good deal. But do you want to spend that money? And also... It doesn't guarantee a five star. I've I've bought it at other Tavern Legend events and I didn't get a single five star. In fact, I only got one four star. So I'm already content. I already got two five stars like very early on. Like this is probably as good as it could have gotten. It would have been better if one of them were Hell or Kingston, but Grizzul is a five star. Glenda, I, I'm excited for. So it's not like it was a total loss. I think a little would have been a loss if I got a five star, but not like. Any, if I had any Tower of Legends hero that I didn't want, it probably Myster Mysterzo or whatever that super hidden one. Uh, like that one's pretty insulting to get, honestly. Um, I guess maybe Thought on Moon would also be pretty bad, just because I already have Sashat, and Sashat's like a way better version of him, so. Which I recently maxed to 20 emblems. So I'm happy about that. Renfield's good though. No, not really. I mean his costume's good. I enjoy his costume a lot. Carver I have no use for. I haven't had a use for him in a hot second. Well, there we go. There's another one. Ha! <laughs> This is definitely a better event, and seeing Cyclo Eradication is pretty good. It's a nice toolkit one. I have a lot of really good yellows I need to level, so unfortunately she's going to be also on the back burner. Um, I still need to level up my Rabbit, Delilah, which is actually my first one because I need a healer. And I still have Costume June too, which I think is better than Neath. Now, Neath isn't bad by any means. It's just she's very uh, situational. I think she's a better offensive tool. She's pretty good on defense, too. She reminds me sort of like a Liju. Sort of. That also blinds. A lot of gray main, though. That's interesting. A lot of four stars. 
Now, most people would be angry about these two, but I'm actually content with them because I already got my five stars. Like, yeah, they're not the ones I wanted, but would I be a pretty dumbass fool if I complained about these since none of them I've had a duplicate of, you know? They're going to forever stay in the collection probably, but at least they're, they exist in my collection now. Liju is honestly probably one of my favorite four stars in the game, in defense especially. Makes an amazing holy tank. And then I get this piece of shit. It's good food, is what it is. Now, the costume I hear is pretty good, but I don't have it. Oops, sorry. Uh, I don't have it yet, so... I don't have it leveled yet. I think I have a Shittle Skull with the costume somewhere in my inventory. Brienne. Like I said, we're, just, we're still the only reason why we're still pulling is because you never know. I've had four four stars in a 30 pull, so... And I've also had all three stars in a 30 pull, so I mean, honestly, it could be both ways. I'm more leaning towards the latter than the former. All right, let's see what we get. Final ticket, right? I think it's the final pull. Sabina? I mean, that's honestly not bad. I'm going to go ahead and save the heroes I got. I mean, it's going to be a lot of food, so. Let me go find them in my... See, there's the Vonda. There's Glenda. Glenda's going to be useful, for sure. Definitely will be leveled. Neath will be in my inventory. I pr and also, Onatel is also another thing I'm doing before her, too. But yeah, same with the Grizzula situation, although there isn't as big of a line for rings. I have Vanda and like one other one I'm working on. So yeah, uh, with that in mind, thanks for watching everyone. If you like this video, please like and subscribe. And have a good evening, morning, and afternoon. I'll see you next time. Peace.